my favorite players I would choose from the past for now. It's a very hard decision. Um, one of my favorite uh, was Howie Long. I love that he was team loyal and that he was uh, a team leader. I love that about him. And he could pull it together for everybody. Um, loyalty is very important to me, so um, he'd be my first choice. And my second is a tough one. I am going to go with Marcus Allen. Even though he left us for Kansas City, um, he was my heart for a long time. And he he was just so explosive. And I think that we need a running back that is as strong as he was back in the day. So that's my, those are my two choices. This is a tough one, because I love all of them. But if I had to pick two, what would be Oh, no, it's all, baby. You gotta go with Bo Jackson as running back. And my main man, Reckon, right here. The assassin, baby. Because that's what it's all about. Raider football. All the way. Number one. Shout out to North Virginia Raider Nation Booster Club. And much respect for all the other Booster Clubs here. It's DC Metro. Doesn't give a fuck if we're 2 and 11. It's all about the love. Three rings, baby. At the rest. Uh, number one is without a doubt um, Jack Tatum. Uh, he is just ferocious, and uh, he's the reason I became a Raider fan. Today. And uh, the other guy, I, I think Howie Long. I, I just love, I love his motor. I love his passion for the Raiders. Shout out to anybody. Um, just happy holidays to everybody who loves the Raiders because you're a unique human being. Thank you. My two favorite Raiders of all time, number one, Jack Tatum, baby. The assassin. Hardest hitting, most feared man in NFL history, period, point blank. My second favorite Raider, Bo Jackson. He's the reason I became a Raider. When I grew up, Bo Jackson was the most popular athlete, so that's how I became a Raider, and that's why I'm here. Oh, first of all, would be Ray Guy. He is the consummate kicker, extraordinaire. He's a southern boy, like southern girl like myself. And probably the second person would be maybe Tim Brown, because we need that, that flash, that speed, that greater heart, heart, heart. That's, like, that's what I would think. My, my favorite player, favorite Raider player, favorite player, period, Tim Brown. I mean, hands down, what, what we need on this team right now is is a veteran wide receiver that can catch over the middle, that can do everything that that do everything that this team needs to be done. Uh, catch on the sideline, extend drives, you know, third and five, make that tough catch over the middle. That's exactly what Tim Brown did over his entire career. I mean, he even run punt returns and kick returns when he needed, and that's exactly what we need right now. Um, and, and number two, I, I, I got to go with my man from the University of Washington, Napoleon Kaufman, Reverend Napoleon Kaufman. I mean, we got some good running backs right now in Latavius Murray, but if we had Napoleon Kaufman right now, I mean, to, to catch those passes off the backfield, to, to be able to break in between the tackles and at that breakaway speed, that's exactly what we need right now, man. I mean, so there are those two. Number one, Lester Hayes. Shut down corner. Can nobody get past him? Shut shit down all by himself, man to man coverage. And of course, Bo Jackson. Run everything over. Can't nobody touch him. In his prime, he destroyed it in that field. Easy. My two favorite players to put in the game, of course, would be Marcus Allen and Bo Jackson. Marcus Allen could dance around anybody. Bo Jackson is too big to take down. You got Smash and Dash right there. They would take us all the way to the bowl game. And if you think I'm wrong, call me. Um, I would, if I could add two players from the past to the current team, I got Jerry Jones. I would choose Marcus Allen because I was in love with Marcus Allen. My first favorite day was in San Diego, I went to San Diego State, and they just came, Marcus Allen was playing, I was just geeky gag out of Marcus Allen. He was a great player, I was just infatuated. And then with Craig Fowler, I guess Allen Allen, because he was just Thank you. Well, two of my favorite painters, of, two of my favorite Raiders of the past, 
Because I was a running back in school, it would definitely be Marcus Allen and Bo Jackson. How they would love to, how they would do to help us out right now because our run game has been slacking. And right now we need all of that top talent that we can get and those two, you know, will bring it. <laughs> uh, well, we, we have a quarterback. We have Derek Carr. I was leaning towards saying Rich Gannon, but uh, I guess I would have to say Bill Romanowski and Jerry Rice. Why? Well, Bill Romanowski would help shore up the defense, and we have some good young defensive guys, Seal Moore and Khalil Mack, and he would provide some veteran leadership, and then Jerry Rice, obviously, he would be able to help the wide receiver for him. I would like to have Jack Tatum lead our defense, and my man Jim Plunkett from San Jose lead our offense. Those are, in my opinion, two of the smartest Raiders players to ever don the silver and black. Ray Guy and Jack Tatum. Great guy, brought the intensity of punting the ball. When I was a kid, I always wanted to be a punter. And when I first, my first little league team I played on, I was a punter for our team. Now, with Jack Tatum, he brings the intensity and the game crunching hits. And that's why I became a Raider fan. A player from the past that I would love to see play on the team right now is Hall of Famer Willie Brown. Uh, he's an absolute great, obviously, uh, for many reasons. He would bring his enthusiasm, his, um, his athleticism, his wisdom, obviously, that he has for the many years that he's played um, in this league. And he would be a good mentor to the people who are currently on the team now. He's um, extremely quick on his toes. Um, it's just a pleasure to be around. I've had the distinct pleasure of actually meeting him while he was part of the organization. So, someone I would love to see play for me. Two Raiders I'd like to have back would be Jim Plunkett. That was a working horse cowboy. Jack Taylor. We need more players like him in our team. The energy, the fear factor. We need more Jack Taylor. We're going to go old school for y'all on this one right here. If we could bring back a couple of Raiders from the past, again, one of them won a championship, but two of them played hardcore. The two that I'm talking about, they didn't play long, but people don't remember who they are. Number 26, the four they call him, that motherfucker had heart. The way he could bust out and open, couldn't catch him. The second Raider, Bo Jackson. I don't even have to say nothing else. The third round, 21 defense. Monster defense. How long? You put how long on this defense right now, worse than the quarterback? He's, he was J.J. Watt before J.J. Watt even came. Two Raiders I want to see from the past are oh, so many. But right now, because of our game, how we're playing, I would love to see Cliff Brandt with the long ball and Jim Plunkett giving it to him. That way we can score real quick, fast, like the old Al Davis play.